And 27th in the nation, he'll go up against the freshman Caden Milheim out of Muncie, Pennsylvania, a guy that AU excited about. Of course, one of the issues always is that young freshman first match, Jason Brelli said, like, I'm kind of uncomfortable putting the freshman out there first match bender against Maryland, but it's the way things have kind of rolled. They're going to give Milheim a shot here. Yeah, this is a great test for Milheim. I mean, every, uh, you know, Coach Brelli, you know, obviously, you know, you want to make sure your guys are ready to go when they come in, but this is a great opportunity um, to wrestle a top-ranked guy for Milheim to kind of set the tone for his career and his season, and if he can wrestle hard here, that's a, you know, and maybe even pull out a win, that's a, that's a great start. Normally, Jack Neese would be the 157 for the Eagles, but going with Milheim tonight. North going to work on the freshman. Yeah, North in on that. Single trying to cut the corner, but Milheim cuts it back. Draws a stalemate. We, we kind of were talking before the broadcast started, Jason, and it's one of the good things... If you're going to throw a freshman out there, one from PA is probably your best bet because of the level of competition in high school. And, and seen what Michael North probably brings to the table, but he's probably seen some things that this won't be maybe the welcome to college experience we hope for Milheim here. Right, exactly. And, you know, yeah, you, those, those guys in Pennsylvania, they get, they get this level of wrestling in high school. So it's, uh, you know, we see Milheim in on his own shot here, not hesitating to build up trying to work up, cutting that corner. North with a good shin wizard, staying tight. Milheim kind of separating his power. Got one hand on the mat, one hand on the leg. Might see a stalemate here if no improvement. Out Clemson quickly up off the bench. Couldn't tell if he had a complaint with his wrestler or the official. Back to you know Milheim kind of feeling feeling getting being in Bender for his first time, you know being wrestling at that high level in high school in Pennsylvania. You know it is important to remember it is just your first match. It is just a match. Yep. This isn't a national tournament. Go out there and wrestle. Go out there. Do what you've been doing all preseason, all beginning of this season right now in the room. And um, you know North does a good job staying diligent and gets that takedown, but. Wrestling North real tough here in the first period. Milheim finished third in the state in Pennsylvania the last two years. Also has two brothers who wrestle, so wrestling family, which yeah. has to be a great thing because you're always wrestling. Absolutely, and big news this week, uh, one of his brothers committed. Um, you know, top, top 100, top 50 uh, high school kid in his class, so big, uh, big pickup by the Eagles uh, last week. So three nothing advantage for Michael North. Can he put more points on the board here? Adding up the riding time, come up on 45 seconds there, but no more in this period. Yeah, Maryland, where they brought the entire team tonight, so the guy is not wrestling or a probable sitting over to the side, but they're bringing some energy. Atmosphere here tonight at Bender. Hope to see you out here. Rest of the season, a lot of good dual meet action here in DC. Come check it out. Yep, North chooses bottom here. Milheim wrestling tough from that crab ride, call ride. Um, just got to keep following, keep improving there. And, and you could tell just kind of looking at the bodies, freshman versus senior in those years of weight training, what it can do, but you also have to like the way Milheim's acquitting himself so far against a pretty daggone good wrestler. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, he's great, putting on a great, like I said, call ride there, able to get both boots in. Um, you know, great ride. This this is something that, that you guys practice all summer long, all year long, top work. They want to ride you on top, get that riding time point, and just break you down on top. And we've seen that today with the guys that have been able to get on top. 
Right now we're seeing Old Milheim, he's doing a great job riding tough. Um, Jack Maida did a great job in the first match. Now he just needs to start working for a turn. He's looking to get that right side arm bar in. Not able to get it though. Still working hard, keeping pressure. So yeah, you see that stalemate call. When you got dull boots in, it's really hard for the guy on bottom to get up or do anything. Um, so, you know, we go to that stalemate first. I think the next one they're gonna call a stall depending on who it is. Probably the bottom guy. Kind of depends on the ref um, from time to time. Making it tough, North trying to get out, and he will get his point. So now four nothing lead for North. Yeah, that's uh, you know, North. You know, put a couple moves together and was able to get out. Milheim's got to be able to feel that coming. Guy's gonna move on bottom, keep following. Uh, but North does a good job getting out. Under 15 seconds left to go in the period. We have a late time move here. That'll do it. So to the third period we go as Michael North has the 4-0 lead. Chance for Milheim to get a point here with an escape. Again, that three-point takedown match is definitely not out of reach. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, you got an escape and a takedown. You're right back in it real quick. Um, but that's a... North, haven't seen North on, you know, on, done a whole lot on top today, but we'll see what he can do to ride and can't right now. And that's an eagle escape, Mr. Milheim, on the board. North there on a nice single, sitting to come out the back door. Good f attempt to finish. Milheim holding tight, gonna get two, excuse me, gonna get three. That one's gonna be tough to shake. Did that look like one of the first freshman moments of the match for Milheim to you? Yeah, a little bit. And I was gonna say when they were on their feet, he got the escape, kind of saw Milheim a little, not the word is escaping me, but kind of rushing, rushing yep. when he was on there, kind of didn't, you know, kind of got to remember, you know, be in the moment, wrestle in the moment. Don't get too excited. We got the escape. All right, let's get back to the center and get back to what we were. Get back in that single leg where he was early in the match. Um, but he kind of just got a, you know, a little ahead of himself. And uh, North took advantage of it. North can get the riding time point if he can ride him out the rest of the period. Just get it over one minute. Big for Milheim to get him back up on his feet here. And if he is able to get back up, and you know, I'm not sure. It doesn't look like Maryland's trying to cut him here, so not looking for a major. Um, but if he does get up, you know, he's got to just get back, get solid, stay solid, and keep him off. But it looks like he's just going to try to ride him out. Yeah, Alex Clemson on the bench with his arms crossed. Doesn't look like a coach trying to get that strategy point in there. So they're going to be content with the win, but not a bad debut. Or Caden Milheim against a ranked wrestler, Michael North. Fought very well in that one. Comes up, though, with an 8-1 to one loss. North taking the victory. Another one on the board for Maryland as they add on to the team score. Now 15-4, Terps up. Yeah, good win here by North. Um, you know, good wrestling by Milheim.